Just into our newsroom tonight, the Clayton County Sheriff says he is has arrested one of his own. So he made this announcement in the last three hours here, folks, saying the arrest stems from an inmate who was allegedly assaulted inside the Clayton County Jail. 11 Alive's Cody Alcorn joins us live right now outside the jail. So, Cody, what do we know about tonight's arrest? Ron, the sheriff says this officer has been fired, accused of setting up an inmate to be attacked by multiple inmates. On Saturday, Sheriff LeVon Allen says an inmate was attacked inside the Clayton County Jail, prompting an investigation the sheriff dubbed think it's a game. Everybody that comes to my jail should be treated, treated with respect and with dignity. Sheriff Allen not playing around. He says the investigation into the attack led straight back to one of his own. Correctional officer Jalen Klossel, the sheriff says he was fired on the spot and arrested. Everything I do is going to be to protect the, uh, the citizens, the employees, and other contractors and inmates of the jail. Since May, Sheriff Allen has arrested seven of his own inside the jail, including now former correctional officer Sean Hollinshead, accused of planning and carrying out a vicious attack on an inmate that left him with life-threatening injuries. The next day, Sheriff Allen had then officer Tabitha Clifton and nurse Jessica Castellanos arrested for their roles in the same attack on the inmate. The other arrests stem from stealing from inmates, financial fraud, and bringing in contraband. Sheriff Allen says he's committed to not just cleaning up the streets of Clayton County, but also his jail. That's the goal. If, if, if my brother or sister got arrested here today, I don't want them to get shanked or get killed. Besides this correctional officer being arrested for this latest attack, four inmates were also charged with aggravated assault.